Good day to all of you. Now I'm going to show you what are the things need to do, preparations and operation need to check prior the crane is being used while arrival on port. Before the ship is arrived on port, we must need cooperation of the AVs, OS, boson, or even a chief mate or chief engineer to do some checks to have the crane being operational while it is in use at port. On top, there he is my chief engineer checking the cable conditions and drum stabilizer condition. Down, here is one guy, he is standby and assisting the ABs and the chief engineer while doing a check. It is very important before arrival on port, you need to do a weaker insulation check on the plug of the crane which need to be put on our ground. This is my crane and on top there is two motors, the drum motor and the cable motor. The drum cable is the cable stabilizers and we need also to check all lights. All lights must need to be operational prior to arrival at port. This is the crane number 4 and on top there is a pulley we need to put a grease on it. While the AP is grease on the pulley, I'm doing, I'm doing uh, insulation check for all the cables, plugs. We need also to check the relays for drum and cables. As you will find here on my left is the real drum cable. And this is the controller to open and close the prop. And also, this is a controller responsible to use on a drum and cable stabilizer. This is my grab. Inside have motors. We need to do insulation resistance check on the coil windings of the motors. This is a reverse forward motors which operate on forward or reverse direction to open and close the grab. It's very important to check that all lights are working so that during night time the crane operator will be able to see the loaded item. This is the crane console from which you will start and stop the crane operate the lights and you command the hoisting up and down. This is a power cable. Now the crane operator on the crane number one is started to run the cable motor to lay further the cable laid out to our grab. And the boson now is ordered the operator to do more releasing of the power cable. As on forward is a power cable and on the backward is the stabilizer cable. This is our grab and this is our crane hook. This is my second mate. And now here will be the boson and over there is the second mate and boson fixing the crane hook on our grab. Now, he is coordinating with the crane operators and now the AB is also assisting us. To Preparing a crane grab takes a lot of time. It takes about 1 hour and 30 minutes. What you will see here, this is the power cable to the grab motors. And the other one is the 
stabilizer cable that holding a cable not to twist on the glove. We plug in the power plug on power socket provided on the glove motors. And very important to tighten it. This is the string for uh, cable stabilizer. For testing purpose, we are just put the cable stabilizer as you will see there. And after this, we are going to test the grab by opening and closing. Normally, the glove will open about 12 to 15 seconds and close about 10 to 12 seconds. Okay guys, now our crane grab is ready. We put already the power cable from crane to the crane motor grab and the stabilizer cable from the crane reel to the grab. Now, we are going to start a testing on it. The pattern you need to put a duct tape in between the crane hook so that you are eliminated from jumping over on the hook the grab. As you will find, we leave first the crane grab, then we are going to test and do opening and closing 10 times. Now the crane operator started to hoisting up a command. Then we lifted the crane grab, make sure that the cable wheel, stabilizer and power cable wheel motors is in automatic mode so that you will eliminate to break the cable while the hoisting hook is going down or moving up. Yun, sabay. Sabay gagalaw yung kable at saka yung hook. Pag naka-automatic. Okay. Okay. Ibinira na yung coming drop. Tapos, open, close. Open, close tayo. Yun. Close. One. This is magnetic contactor which is responsible to rotate the motor in forward and reverse to open and close the grab. This is the magnetic contactor responsible to control and rotate the cable drum of the power cable and power stabilizer. Now everything on the crane are ready and I will be going up to show you the actual running winches for jeep in and jeep out the, it is located on lower portion and on the upper portion is for the hoisting up and hoisting down this is our gear this gear is the responsible for stewing movement of your crane moving to the left or moving to the right this crane is moving 360 degrees this is our crane limit switch for jib in and jib out and while the drum for jib in and jib out is rotated this mechanism is continuously moving so we take a look this is a jib in and jib out winches as and on top is our hoisting up and hoisting down winches This yellow indication is a good and healthy weight. This is the length of our rope hoisting from which indicates the hoisting reach from the crane jib. Now I have 20.8 meters and motion here clockwise have a positive 
numbers in, down there is an encoders and that encoders is the one who is responsible to indicate a clockwise or counterclockwise rotation of your hoisting up and hoisting down winches rotating it clockwise indicate a positive values counterclockwise indicate a negative values on top left most part indicates a yellow meaning a good weight if become red meaning your crane is overloaded normally the crane hydraulic oil temperature is set within 65 degrees celsius this is our hydraulic oil filters and this is my temperature controllers from here you will find a crane operator with me and while the crane is working we are just check on it and monitor what is the alarm comes and we make need to assure that the crane is operational without any alarm or defects now i'm here because i have alarm which is keep sounded within five seconds this means i have a low oil level on crane tank okay guys this is the wiring diagram of the siren why we have alarm every five seconds if alarm come meaning the k31 relay is activated and the cable is directed on the float switch on oil level or tank meaning the alarm giving you a pre-warning that your oil level is below a level and you need to refill an oil on tank so guys if you have a problem and some alarm like this just check the wiring diagram with you and you will find how to solve it two three four five that was the ETO life with a ship with a crane the ETO ETR or electrician on board is always coordinated with the duty officers any times that we have a alarm or crane failure they are always calling us so that we keep monitoring all the crane be good working without any failure to avoid any delays on a crane operation now as you will find it's another day good morning and i have here indian guys with me and he is keep looking and monitoring our fertilizers discharging at port bisak india as you notice there is my hour crane now they are not using it and they are using their own cranes hello my friend good Hi. very good very good <laughs> lifting the fertilizer oh look 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 no more ah. finish my friend tomorrow finish yan ang crane namin what is your name my friend okay what is your name patra patra hey my Me name is voices Keep safe, my friend. Keep Maraming truck? Yung mga truck na yan, kinakarga nila yung fertilizer. May bulldozer doon, no? Oh. Yan. Yan yung fertilizer namin. Bali, binaba namin sa India. Ayan. Okay. Ayun, yung crane grab. Patuloy sa paghahakot ng fertilizer galing sa barko namin. Binubus yan. Support. Tapos kukunin lang mga bulldozer. Yun. No? Ganyan. Paano i-discharge ang fertilizer? Welcome to Port India. And here, we are discharging the fertilizers which are taken from Russia. As you will see then, on the front, there is one mobile crane. And this mobile crane has a grab. And took the fertilizers and moving from port side, way 
going to our ship and about 51 50 seconds it takes the jet letters under our cargo hold number one i'm just too much time to before are able to land from the cargo hold of ships up to the fourth way now i have one minute and 36 seconds and still observing the crane how it moves and how much time that the crane is able to discharge the fertilizers about one minute and 54 seconds you see that is how our operation is going on that is a grab crane we are trying to count a time and we are going to do some focus on the grab so that you will see how this fertilizer has been discharged on board this is now i have from 1 minute and 54 seconds i have now 3 minutes and 33 seconds when the grab at three sides of the board i'm going to take focus on it so that you will see how this fertilizer is being discharged here at in the board see now the crane is moving i'm focusing my camera on the map and you will see how it is opening oh 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 those are the tracks now the grab is start of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 seconds the fertilizer is completely discharged at 4 then counts 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 20, 20 seconds the grab will be able to go along from port way to our ship about 20 seconds that is how our discharging operation time is counting very slow but very nice by the way i have here the two grab crane ORTS this is a crane on our ship yan maraming tao sa puerto yan yung crane thank you no? yung mga tao na yan sila yung mga estibador gumagawa rito yan ito yung wire ang kain number 4 dahil maingay daw kaya lang kasi kulito medyo may tama na yung pabili niya oh tama na siya yung kanyang pagkrasa nagkaroon ng mechanical defect kaya pala si kaibigang Richie ang taong laging puyat kapag umagana ang crane laging gising siyempre ako dito ay nagkrisyan bali ganoon talaga ang buhay pag umagana ang crane Pag may problema, natawagan tayo dyan, okay? Mamaya, aakit kami sa taas. Ayun, sila sila jeep kit. Ipopopress yung cream jeep, no? Yes! Sarkas wish. Uy! No? Toma. Tiche! Salamang kas wish na yan. Pam! Chris! Kaya sinagamit namin ito. Ayun, si second mate. Second officer, yeah. All right. Kita kerasa ada di atas. Kami ada di dalam tadi. Kau mari lihat perit bayu sound. Kami nari lihat bayu sound. Dapat kopi cek dengan kolek. Okay. Yeah. Dah kau pikan. Tadi kita kena tadi yang kering. Tadi kering nanti, no. Lut. Yang nak kering nanti. Tapi kita nanti betul tayu tayu yang kering. Tapi kita kerasa ada di dalam. Shit. Okay, may mga bearing dance, loob. Uy! Medyo makalawag na yung mga ano niya. Support and nut. Kailangan ng inundation to. Ayun! Basta na yung tuna. Ayun, kung napansin nyo yun, no? May tunay nyo ako nakita doon. Ano na siya? Ah, ah meron siyang lock, no? Kung nga lang siyang basak. Pero buong tangan. Dito. Buo pa naman. Hindi naman siya rapture. Hindi naman, hindi naman siya raptured Nasa na siguro ito? Wala siyang crack Nasa ito? Ang kulang kaya ito? Ito parang busang sal pero takip lang naman yan Takip lang yan Tanggal lang yan takip lang no? Okay guys, yan o kasama namin si Kipmate Ito yung grease point Ito yung kinagrasahan natin Para doon sa kanya bearing Doon doon punta yung grasa Ito rin, tatlo Apat dito, dito tatlo Ganun, doon Ito yung kanya grease people Right. Ayun, nandito kami sa ibabaw ng umres ng crane jeep. Go. 
Ogi. Yo si Ogi. Nok yung ano kanina? Bakit pa namin oh? Ayan yung Chris Nipon. Pinagrasahan namin para mawala yung hindi magandang sound sa kung hindi mo pinaka nag-e. Oh. Ako si Mike, mabigat. Mabigat na po Good afternoon everyone That is a short crane Mabuhay ang Pilipinas As you will find here they, We have here uh, Two crabs And on the other side You will see the steel coil At the port I have here a two short crane. We are using it to put install these grabs while loading and discharge and fertilizers. Okay guys, thank you for watching. God bless you all. Keep safe, be healthy, be happy. Wishing you all the best. Okay. Look at it, the ship is very nice. And that area is the starboard side. And she will notice there, there is a lot of max people walking. Look, the people is now walking, going to our ship to do the track. This one is easy. We have a very good atmosphere here. And that is the flag of India. There is red, white, and green. See? 